It is no less than a miracle. Kurt Yamoskam would never have walked again. He suffered a spinal cord injury 12 years ago and the 40-year-old had no chance of using his feet again. Today he's back on his feet, walking with the use of crutches thanks to the so-called digital bridge between his brain and the nerves below his injury. Within 5 to 10 minutes I could control my uh, uh, hips like they were like the brain uh, implant uh, picked up what I was doing with my hips so that was uh, like yeah, the best outcome I think for everyone. When Oskam thinks about walking, electrodes in his brain relay the messages to electrodes on his spinal cord, stimulating the spine. Oskam took part in a trial in 2018 that showed, with intensive training, the human mind could trigger artificial electrical impulses to stimulate the spine and spur movement. Now, when Oskam thinks about walking, the skull implants detect electrical activity in the cortex, the outer layer of the brain. So when everything is installed, the patient has first to learn how to work with his brain signals and we also have to learn how to correlate this brain signal to the spinal cord stimulation. But this is pretty short. In a few sessions, everything is linked and the patient starts training. Interestingly, the study and its miraculous results were revealed the same day that an American company Neuralink announced that it had received approval from the U.S. Food and Drug Administration to implant chips in human brains. The announcement was retweeted by Elon Musk, who is the founder of the seven-year-old company. The company claims that its chips can surgically be inserted into the brain by a robot and are capable of decoding brain activity and linking it to the computers. Up until now, the company has conducted research only in animals. It is, however, unclear when the human trial will begin. But what is certain is that it will be another feather in the cap of Musk, who has built a business empire on disruptions from electric cars to space travel, from digital payments to artificial intelligence. Bureau Report, Business Today Television. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.